Hey guys, it's your own boy, the one way great team back with day 449 star drop opening, and today is the mega opening as it is the last day of the SpongeBob season. So I can't believe it came this fast, but also I was just really busy, so I didn't have as much time to play it besides just spamming every mode possible to get crusty cash right during the whole event. Though I can't necessarily say I'll miss having to forcefully play the four different modes every single day to have a chance of getting uh, essentially two <laughs> uh, Spongebob skins this season but again they are free additional items so it's not like I can complain too much but anyway let's get into it rare so we need rare 100 XP doubles rare that's so rare 50 coins rare that's so rare three rares 50 coins but, what I think I'm going to do here, so, again, I have some quests to finish, and I still need to get the last day or today's <laughs> crusty cash, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly pause the video, and I will be back once I've done that. Alright, so, I just completed the quests, as well as any of the maps that I had crusty cash left on it right. so again just getting the two rewards for the supercell store quests which again they're really easy you just pretty much need to log on to the store to claim them really quick but anyway as for the map selection today, we have Ringo Brawlin, Trio Showdown, and Harry Horrors. Again, probably the last time we'll be seeing those for a while. Again, they might bring Trio Showdown back after some tweaks. But we also have Knockout 5v5. And we have Solar Showdown and Hot Zone for the other Krusty Cash modes. Again, I don't think Duo Showdown works for some reason when it comes to events like this. Or at least I, Duo Showdown won't give you the crusty cash even if you make placement. I don't know why, that's just how it's been. Anyway, let's head on over to the crusty crab and I have 10,000 crusty cash left, so regardless, I'm going to be buying whatever SpongeBob skin is there. It is a super deal, so I should have enough reasonably to afford it. Just buy whatever else I can, assuming I even have enough left to buy anything. So we have 500 XP doublers, because I already have all the power-ups. We have a rather expensive star drop offer here. Again, more than half of what I even have is crazy. Again, I think I'd rather get the legendary skin, actually. Again, let's, let's just hope whatever this is isn't crazy expensive. Maybe I can get at least two things. Uh, jeez. Alright, well, again, I'm going to be getting it no matter what. Because I don't really have a choice here. I don't think this leaves me enough to get me. Because with 3,000 blue. Super rare. Star jump. Super rare. 100 blue. Rare. There's 25 power Magic. Why has it got to be 200 power points? Super rare. Super rare. 100 coins. Rare. Rare. 100 XP doubles. Super rare. Super rare. 150 power points. Rare. Rare. 25 power points. Super rare. Super rare. 100 coins. Rare. Rare. 50 coins. Rare. Rare. 50 coins. And a guaranteed legendary level. Oh, come on, let me show you how it's done. Okay, well, I mean, again, it's a decent skin, I suppose. Comes with a pin here. Isn't that one of the. Oh, no, it's Coral Bell. See, so, you know, I have 1,460 crusty cash. I can't even use it on anything. It's not a single thing in the shop I could afford. <laughs> It could top over with gems, but I still don't think it would be worth it, right? Because the whole point of the event is that you can get this stuff for free, so... Yeah, I don't think the lowest offer here, 122 gems, is worth the skin and some bling and XP doublers, so... 
And again, at, at least I got that goofy Squidward laughing pin, you know? That's probably one of the most coveted items in this entire event, I suppose. Again, this is the Mega Star Drop opening. I don't know exactly how many <laughs> I'm going to have opened by the end of this, but I'll try and make sure to count and leave it in the title as usual. But we have nine from the For All Stars Esports event. Epic! Yeah, epic. 100 bling. Unfortunately, this is the only way to really open them. Super rare. Super rare, 100 coins. Super rare. Super rare. 50 power points. Epic! Epic. 100 power points. Rare. Rare. 50 coins. Rare. Twenty-five power points. Super rare. Super rare. Fifty power points. Rare. rare. Twenty-five power points. And we have super rare. rare. Super rare. Hundred coins. Decent enough. But let's head on over to the track here. So. Let's start. Rare. 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 25 power points. Rare. Rare. 100 XP doublers. Rare. Rare. 100 XP doublers. Super rare. Super rare 50 power points. Epic. Epic. 100 bling is alright. Super rare. rare. Super rare. 50 bling. Super rare. Super rare. 100 coins. Epic. Epic. 100 bling again. Rare. Rare 50 coins. Epic. Epic. 100 bling. Super rare. Super rare. 100 coins. Rare. XP doublers. Rare. 50 coins. Rare. Rare 50 coins. Rare. Rare 25 power points. Super rare. Super rare 50 bling. Mythic. Mythic. 500 coins. Okay. Super rare. Super rare 100 coins. Rare. Rare 50 coins. Rare. Rare 50 coins. Rare. Rare 25 power points. Super rare. Super rare. 200 XP doublers. Epic. Epic. Over 100 power points. And. Rare. 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 25 power points, and I'll save the guaranteed legendary after these 31 additional star drops. Rare. Yeah, rare 50 coins. Epic. Epic. Super rare. Super rare. 50 power points. Rare. Rare. And 25 power points. Super rare. And super rare. 100 coins. Rare. Rare. 50 coins. Rare. 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 50 coins again. Super rare. Super rare. 100 coins. Rare. Rare. 25 power points. Legendary. Uh, we have a legendary first one so far. Or actually, I guess there was that guaranteed one in the Krusty Krab, but yeah, all right. We have our first legendary from just a random star drop. About 500 credits. Ooh, looks like I'm hitting a new fame rank. Okay, what do I get? <laughs> right? Rare. Rare. 100 XP doublers. Okay, I'm assuming I get something, but it's probably in my inbox or something. Rare. Rare. 25 power points. Rare. Rare. 25 power points. Super rare. Super rare. 100 points. Rare. Rare. 100 XP doublers. Mythic! Mythic! 
Interestingly enough. Okay, I think that was another one of those crusty offers, right? I must be thinking of something else then. Oh, I, I know what it is. I had a quest to play as Ruffs, so for some reason I always think of Ruffs as that skin. Because that's the one most people use, I guess. At least if they have it, of course. But yeah, again, not much else I can do there. And, uh... I didn't even know there was a free mastery track going on. I guess this is a Kenji related um reward thing, right? And they're actually all free. Sushi for all, okay. Starting with a sushi spray. So you have some other sprays uh, I mean it's it's just a lot of sprays really and just some other additional rewards thrown in there, coins and powerpoints. <laughs> Again, can't complain about free. <laughs> I don't know how much I'd use any of these sprays, but again, pretty cool that they're doing that. So again, we have the Kenji value pack for six more hours. Again, I'm probably just going to pick him up immediately after the new season starts, pretty much with the amount of credits I'll have. But for the daily freebie, we have 15 coins, as well as 10 power points. And we still have the World Finals offer for two days. I'll probably end up picking that up by the end of the day as well. But it looks like they removed most of the other offers in the shop. So again, this is finally the end of the SpongeBob season. I don't think there's really much else going on here today. Again, you guys just got to remember to head on to the Supercell store to claim your bonus rewards if you've completed those quests. And... Make sure to spend your crusty cash because you will not be compensated for anything you have left. Which again is why it's so unfortunate that I still have a whole 1,400 left because I just can't do anything with it. And again, at least I was able to get four total Spongebob skins this season. One from my club being active, one from just purchasing the pass, and then two uh, from just playing through it again i technically probably could have gotten at least one more had i bought the offers that i had for six thousand previously but you know again it was hard to say that i couldn't get better offers so again decent enough overall but as of today i now have 1500 xp doublers and 92,728 power points but again from what i understand in the time to explain podcast they will eventually be doing something to make the PowerPoint issue a little less ridiculous, so I won't have to make a grimace every time <laughs> I get PowerPoints in my star drops. Because, again, I assume they bring back some type of conversion, or maybe they'll just have something else interesting happen if you have an unreasonable amount of PowerPoints. So, again, I don't even remember what the next season is. But if you guys are excited, let me know. Let me know how your crusty cash situation is looking. And let me know how you feel about the free sushi for all thing going on in the shop. But other than that, let's see how far I can take this, guys. <laughs> 